Le président, veuillez vous asseoir. L'audience est ouverte. We would like now to hand over to counsel for Mr. Ying Sari to proceed with the remaining questions to Mr. Sun Sikun. Thank you, Mr. President. If we could now turn to another subject or another topic, and I want to discuss a little bit about the incident with Toi Kum Doon. And you've told us that uh, in your testimony on August 6, you told us that he was taken away when uh, Mr. Yang Sari was on an official trip to Malaysia. And then you've indicated that at one point you recall his confession being read out. And then, based on that question, you are asked to identify some of the individuals that would have been there. And I believe you indicated that it would have been Chun Prasit and Ki Chun, as well as Ok Sokun. Do you know whether Ok Sokun is alive or dead? Savez-vous si Ok Sokun est vivant ou décédé? Response. I think Ok Sokun was not included in that. Because according to Toi Kam Dun, in his confession, he stated that there was a CIA cell Il a mentionné la présence and the person in, de la CIA. Uh, the, 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 the code name is S808 Portant le nom de code and there were four individuals um, including myself, Jun Prasit, Ha Sien Lai Ni, and Kit Chun, not Aok Sukun. Okay. And so those were the individuals that would have been present supposedly when the, this meeting took place and when the confession of Toi Kum Doon was read out. That's your recollection. C'est ainsi que vous vous rappelez les faits? Response. Réponse. I do not remember this clearly. It, 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 was it, it, it is possible that he could uh, be present as he was uh, one of the main cadres uh, at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Well, I guess my, uh, my question, and I don't want to belabor this point, but you seem to indicate that there was a meeting, that the confession was read out, Au cours de laquelle and we know that these uh, Tune Prasit and Kichun were present. Et Ki and there may have been présent. one other person, including yourself. Parmi vous Is that your recollection? Est-ce que c'est ce dont vous vous souvenez? Response. I do not remember this clearly whether or whether Mr. Kitchun si or Chun Prasad si was in that Prasad meeting, but réunion. it was likely that they could have been there because qu y uh, they were key Parce que cadres des at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs who were supposed to be in the meeting. Des affaires étrangères. Et ils étaient censés assister okay, so aux now réunions. let me get this straight, Question. because I'm a little confused. Now you seem to indicate they may clair. not have been there. Vous semblez Whereas when the prosecutor was asking peut, you questions, Alors, quand you vous indicate, vous avez dit, okay, the follow. I cannot recall the exact date of the, date the meeting. De la Present there, as I recalled, I, re I could not recall all the participants. I'd rather say so. However, 
I believe it was in 1977. Usually the attendees général, were those cadres who worked within my section, ma section, that is, within diplomatic affairs section. section des they were also close friends of Tukam Doon, including Chu Prasit, Ki Chun, Ok Sakun. And for the record, I'm reading from the transcript on August 6, and it was Khmer 0083-22-05-06, French 0083-31-68-66. And then in English, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, individual Je cadres, each individual cadre in the meeting. I know that the majority of the cadres were there, and uh, these people held uh, the same positions as uh, that of uh, me, and they Ces could have been there in the meeting. Avaient une fonction équivalente à la mienne, et okay, thank you. Présent, la Merci. And uh, one other matter. And this goes back to what we discussed earlier when you talked about Paul Pot, and that Pol uh, he did not, um, he would not accept Vous avez dit to be um, any contradictions. Il aucune uh, you seem to indicate here that you, you say that if mixing Sari You've said, you've said this in the past. Cas, if Mr. Yang Sari had been there, vous avez dit que si uh, Sari that he could not have been removed. Turkoydun would not have been removed if Mr. Yang Sari si was present. Sari avait été present. And I want to refer you to your statement Je vous of à ce que vous avez dit. the 20th of March 2009, 2009, it's E3 slash 371, it's page 4 in English, it's Khmer 00-28-82-36-37, French 00-28-82-36-37, in English, 00290415. And as part of your answer, Dans votre réponse, you say vous dites, that I would add je cite, that Toy Kam Doon was very close to Ying Sari. Ying Sari having himself been president of Etudiant Khmer. And in my opinion, this arrest could never have taken place had Ying Sari been president of Phnom Penh. And here you seem to be giving an opinion. And I need a point of clarification. Are you speculating when you say that, Lorsque in your opinion, this could never have taken place cela in light pu of your produire, previous answers where you seem to indicate vous des that Car what Pol Pot wanted, vous Pol Pot got, que Pol Pot that he had the discretion and he would not tout tolerate contradiction. Tout pouvoir d'appréciation et qu'il ne tolérait aucune contradiction. The president, uh, witness, could you please hold on? Le président, co prosecutor, you may now proceed. La parole est au co -procureur. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Thank you, Mr. President. La première partie de la question the first part of the question me convient, savoir de suits me that if to say knowing if the witness, when he se livre à une spéculation, is speculating à une analyse, uh, when analyzing that situation, but when the defense adds to that lien avec the link ce a dit à with de what Paul he said Pot, regarding Pol Pot, Here, I think that uh, 
le témoin a spéculé uh, uh, ou en tout cas c'est une question qui me semble orientée donc il me semble que la première partie like de la question, question so n'est pas la seconde question is okay, Merci, but not the second. I'll be happy with Maître him answering the first part of the question. Navas, I'll leave it to your honors to decide si to link la the previous answer with this answer. Je laisse uh, au président le choix de déterminer ce qu'il en est du lien entre la sir, question précédente et celle-ci. That in your opinion, Monsieur le témoin, quand vous dites que d'après vous, are you speculating? Etc. Etc. Est-ce que vous vous livrez à de la spéculation? Response. You may say, yes, I am. On peut dire que oui. Yes, that, uh, Because there is still certain of curiosity in the, that uh, the question put to uh, uh, the allegations against Mr. Toi Kam Dun, uh, he was implicated as those Toy who wrote uh, about the situation within the CPK and had his uh, uh, report submitted to uh, CIA agent il aurait remis un rapport à abroad. la CIA d'après les allégations. And his wife was also part of the informant. Et Sir, I just wanted to know whether you were speculating when you gave that answer. I think you answered the question and the President has already indicated that you need not give any further explanations. Now let me turn to explanation. because we are short of time, not that I don't wish to have you expand on these answers. Uh, if we could uh, discuss Kichun and Chiu Proseth, uh, and here I am interested in some of your answers ce qui m'intéresse ce sont certaines des réponses que vous avez données that you gave on august 7th le 7 août and you were asked and this can be found je vous renvoie on khmer 00 à la page suivante en khmer and you were asked, how did you learn vous that Chun Prasit, along with Ki Chun, had been incriminated in a number of documents? documents? And then you're asked, was this discussed at et meetings? Vous a été des and réunions. your answer is et vous avez as ceci. follows. I knew because I was Je told by Yang Sari, parce que Yang Sari and me dit, I learned of that during the meeting when he said so, à la réunion lorsqu'il but a dit. I cannot recall the exact ne detail, pas bien des détails. Uh, date of the meeting. Ou plutôt, sur so this was your testimony date exact de la réunion. on August voilà ce que vous avez 7th. Dit le 7 août. Now, keeping that in mind, I would like to go to tenu de cela, your statement nous allons reprendre of 6 May 2009. E3 slash 42. That would be page 8 in English. Page 8 du texte anglais. Uh, it's Khmer 00 32 72 French 00 32 72 In English 00 32 Nine. And here is the answer that you give. Voici la que vous ici. Ying Shiri did not inform me personally. Pas he said that in a meeting Il of General Policy Department, if I remember co uh, correctly, de attended de by his close assistants, Chu Persith, Ki Chun, Tuk Kam Dun, Ok Sakun. And then you, the others are, are mentioned. So here we have 
a slight contradiction. Ici, il y a donc in your statement, you seem to say, or you do say, the statement of 6 May 2009, la that Mr. Yingsui did not inform you personally, que ne but vous a you learned of it in a meeting, mais que vous en avez but in your testimony of August 7th, que le 7 août, dans le you say that vous Mr. Yingsui told you, Yingsari, vous avez and you learned it cela in a meeting. Vous vous avez entendu cela également lors d'une réunion. Is it possible that you misspoke in court and that what you told the investigators dans le back in que ce que vous avez 6 dit aux May 2009, 2009 is more in line with your recollection? Était davantage conforme aux souvenirs que vous avez gardés. The president réponse. Council, I think there is a kind of uh, misleading information here. I was Je pense que ces informations ne sont pas in exactes. The confession. Été mis en I was dans implicated in the confession that I and Kit Chun belong to a CIA disant, network et like the de person la CIA. who uh, wrote the confession. De même que l'auteur des aveux. And also, I, I wrote my autobiography um, about this. Mon autobiographie, j'ai mentionné cela. I learned of this through et appris a cela full session of the meeting. Dans le cadre so I only re, uh, state according to the best of my recollection. La réponse que j'ai faite, uh, thank you. That's, sur what, mes that's what we're asking for. Now, La défense, c'est exactement ce que nous vous demandons de faire. D91-26 D91-26 And this is your statement Il s'agit d'une déclaration que vous avez faite This is your statement of December 19 2007 2007 And if we could look at, it would be page four in English. Je vous renvoie à la page the ERN numbers, numbers are um, Khmer, Khmer 00 You say here, Ici, in one of your answers, dans une de vos réponses, as I knew it, any one of those, anyone whose case had three documents in which they had been implicated was arrested. Dans trois documents and then arrêté. you go on. Ensuite, vous poursuivez. Uh, as for Ki Chun Quant and Chu Prasad, they had Prasad, tens of documents. Il y avait but Yang Sari told Pol Pot that if Ki Chun and, and and Chun Prasad were Prasad arrested, arrêté, the entire foreign ministry would have been tout le wiped out. Des affaires étrangères auraient été and supprimé. as I understand it, part of your testimony is si that this was bien, also said vous avez dit dans votre at the meeting when these two gentlemen were present. Lorsque ces deux personnes étaient présentes. Is that correct? Yes, exact. Response. Mr. President, uh, could uh, Council be instructed to Réponse. specify Monsieur le Président, uh, on à which date the meeting was convened de and la date what de la the meeting en was about? La défense. Uh, sir, I wasn't at these meetings. Monsieur, je pas uh, présent you provided testimony here. Vous avez you fait also fait gave Vous avez aussi fait des déclarations. And you have indicated you have indicated that these vous avez indiqué matters were discussed que ces questions ont été at the meetings. Abordées lors des réunions. Do you recall today, as you sit here today, do you recall vous souvenez these vous meetings taking place de ces réunions? and Ki Chun and Chun Prasit being present where 
était-il présent a discussion was held about documents discussion against them, a eu lieu sur des discussions and were sur des documents Yang Shari les mettant en cause told Pol Pot et supposément Yang Sari aurait dit à Pol Pot two, que sans ces deux-là on n'avait plus qu'à fermer le ministère Response. Réponse. I remember that there was meeting I attended Je me and that meeting Mr. Yingsari apprised us of Yang the Sari information nous a as such. Relaté ces informations. However, whether Mr. Jun Prasad or Kit Chun was present or not, I do not recollect. Je ne sais pas si Kichun well, in your state, uh, you do indicate la défense. Dans votre that they were present when supposedly Yang Sari informed them that they had all these documents against him. Les Are you now saying that contre you could have been mistaken que maintenant vous nous dites que vous avez when you said that? Commis une erreur en disant cela? Response. Réponse. No, that's not the case because non, there were several cas. meetings. Il y a eu plusieurs réunions. And uh, perhaps that falls into another meeting, not the meeting that you're asking me about. And lors autre this réunion event et pas happened à la réunion sur laquelle vous m'avez interrogé. A long time Tous ces événements ago, remontent à bien longtemps. And I still only remember just a brief picture of it. Et je All right n'est gardé qu'un souvenir partiel de tout ça. Now, do you know whether question Tun Prasith and, si and Kichun were present Kichun when Mr. Yang Sari supposedly said as you claim dit, comme vous le that without them que the Ministry of Foreign Affairs would have to be shut down. But this is what he informed plus Pol Pot. Ce serait ce qu'il aurait dit à Pol Pot. Response. Réponse. I do not remember precisely as Je ne m'en souviens pas bien. All right. La défense. Très bien. Thank you. Based on that answer, I'll, I'll move on. Compte tenu de cette réponse, je passe à autre chose. Now, you did indicate that you learn that Ki Chun had 60 documents. And in fact, it appears documents. that you even knew some details Et that was in these documents. Vous avez eu de and I just want a clear documents. understanding of your testimony. Je bien votre Are you telling us here Est -ce que vous nous dites that you saw ici the actual documents que vous avez vu les where documents Ki Chun was mentioned some 60 times Ki -chun purportedly to be à 60 I guess, an enemy of the people or spy documents dans lesquels uh, Kichun était présenté comme un ennemi ou comme un espion Response. I have not seen in person the documents Je n'ai pas vu personnellement ces documents concerning this, uh, but for, uh, with regard to Mr. Kirchhoff, I was Kitchon, informed uh, through the meeting été informé à about réunion. him, and uh, I was told lui. that uh, he had sixty documents. Il y avait 60 documents. And when he attended lui. a dinner party, when. Mr. Toi Pun was the uh, minister. He would uh, party, have been called to Monsieur attend the party ministre, every now and then. I was also invited, but I did not like uh, going to party. So only uh, on one, one occasion that he went to the party, he was implicated on that document. À il est allé so, à une fête et mm. en cause dans un document. Thank you. I think you've answered that part of the question. Défense, now my next question was, since this was question. being discussed in the meeting, as you claim, en a été that he had 60 réunion, documents, vous le à savoir il y avait 60 documents uh, do you know whether Kichun would have also have learned Kichun that he had 
documents against him. lui-même appris qu'il y avait des documents contre lui puisque ces réunions n'étaient pas secrètes. réponse. I may say that uh, Mr. Kit Chun learned that he was implicated il aurait appris qu'il y avait tant de documents pesants Mr. contre Kichun lui. Also Savez-vous si M. Kichun était aussi présent Response. Réponse. I cannot, uh, be more precise than Je ne peux this pas être plus précis que cela. The Confessions were read on several occasions. Les aveux ont été lus à plusieurs occasions. So I could uh, uh, say that uh, Mr. Kitchen could have been there. Il se peut que Monsieur Kitchen était présent. The president. Le président. Mr. Witness, please be reminded Monsieur that témoin. You are not allowed to speculate. Je vous rappelle que vous n'êtes pas autorisé à le vous livrer à de la spéculation. Vous n'êtes pas autorisé à vous fonder sur des conjectures. No Car ces conjectures n'ont aucune valeur probante. La Chambre vous a déjà informé du fait que vous deviez répondre aux questions en vous appuyant sur les souvenirs que vous avez gardés, en vous appuyant sur votre expérience that you witnessed. And if you keep saying that you think si vous continuez de dire que you vous guess, pensez, que vous devinez, que vous supposez, this statement that comes, uh, uh, come after the expression would not be propos perceived to be of any property value. Could you then probante. be reminded again that uh, you Une should be plus, as precise as possible to say yes or no en répondant par oui know. ou par non ou en disant le cas échéant que vous ne savez Thank pas. You, Mr. La Now, to Merci, topic, Monsieur le Président. Passons à autre chose. Be, uh, that, à savoir wrote. la biographie que vous avez rédigée. First, Premièrement, je vous renvoie à ce qu'a dit ici dans le prétendu un autre témoin au sujet de votre biographie. Il s'agit de la déposition of Mr. Chang, de M. Yuk Chang. Of en date du 1er février 2012. En particulier, il y a la page 80 de la transcription en anglais. Le Khmer est 0077-65-92. En français, 0077-64-75-94. Et en anglais, 0077-63-53-53. And the ERN number of the document, by the way, is E1 slash 37.1. C'est le document E1 bar 37.1. He was being asked a series of questions concerning biographies. Plusieurs questions and lui ont été posées sur les biographies. One of his answers. Et voici une de ses réponses. He says, Il a of dit, course, je cite, there are different bien types sûr, of biographies. De biographie. The biography of Sun Sukun alias Kung. That is a self biography that the person wrote about his personal involvement, par la personne elle-même sur sa propre participation, the revolution, sur la façon dont la personne a adhéré à la révolution, And etc. That type of biography was done Ce type de biographie on a six -month était basis. établi tous les six mois. And he was referring to, for the record, Et D154.3. Il a fait référence au document D154.3, à savoir Now, la biographie de cette personne. Is, is Ma question est la suivante. Est-ce que looking at your biography, a raison it seems to be the type of biography that was written on a six-month basis? Six Réponse. C'est absolument faux. 
Thank you. Uh, now, Merci. if we go to uh, to see what the president, uh, council, could you please hold down? Uh, international co prosecutor, you may uh, proceed. Uh, but uh, if it is an objection, that it would be related. Uh, Elle arrive, uh, and trop tard. Uh, if you would like uh, to ask a counsel to si vous rephrase uh, the question, à la then la question, uh, you would not also be, uh, you would not be allowed because you are not permitted to advise party to frame the question according to what you propose. But if you have any other matter to resume, go ahead. Le faire, mais si notre question, Merci, Monsieur le Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, uh, sais, vous venez de aux you have just reminded the witness that he should not speculate uh, de manière courte, and that he should answer in a brief manner. And de cela. the a witness is fully aware of this. And the question that was put to him, a été, uh, la réponse, en tout cas, or in any case, a été the coupée, answer to the previous question was cut off. And we didn't understand the witness's justifications. I think that we should allow the witness to express himself fully. And we cannot ask to only answer by yes or by no, certain questions require explanations, and I think it is normal to allow him to finish uh, his Merci. answer. Thank you. If I may briefly respond, because I don't répondre. wish the gentleman to come back yet Je for another day, uh, if he gives uh, answers that are really well beyond the purpose of the question. Qui uh, we've heard question. his testimony extensively Nous concerning his biography, so we have that in the court. Biographies. It was asked both by the prosecution and it may have been asked by the uh, members of the bench. Aussi par des juges. I just read to him Je an individual who came into court lu la déposition who personne qui est venue dans le viewed as somewhat of an expert, having qui a été reviewed comme un expert, more or less all the biographies that qui a are contained at DC toutes les biographies, CAM archives. Des archives du DC CAM. It was the witness himself le who, uh, who mentioned the gentleman's name, qui a cité le nom de la personne en question. and uh, it would appear that this was in line of, in, in, this was an answer to a question posed by the prosecution themselves. I then just asked the gentleman to confirm whether this is whether the witness, Mr. Yuk Cheng, got it right. Si Monsieur Yuk Cheng no. avait raison, ce témoin-ci a dit non. I'm satisfied with that. Je suis pleinement satisfait de cette réponse et j'entends passer aux questions suivantes. If this is not the sort of biography that one gives every six months, very well. Si ce n'est pas le type de biographie rédigée tous les six mois, très bien. I'm perfectly willing to Je suis tout à give fait the gentleman prêt more opportunity to respond, but if you can keep it within two minutes, de répondre that's, plus avant. that's the problem that I'm having. Mais... Mais à condition que cela ne dépasse pas deux minutes. Uh, sorry, I, uh, the president, Le president, witness may continue responding to uh, the last question posed by the council, and please uh, keep your response brief. You are now instructed to uh, clarify your response. Um, to the question, you may proceed. Witness, thank you, Mr. President. Le témoin. Merci, Monsieur le Président. The circumstance under which I, were, I was asked to write my biography was extraordinary because uh, that was also, I was also implicated in the confession by Mr. Sarin that uh, I uh, and uh, Mr. Ketchun were the agent of CIA and Mr. Ying Sari uh, called me uh, to see him in his office and he instructed me to uh, prepare this biography. Uh, thank you. That's in the, you've already testified to that and we will, we will get to it. Uh, and 
just to go on to the next part of this question of Mais mine, which is uh, E1, I'm referring to E1 slash 95.1, the transcript of, of uh, David Chandler, de la de David who testified Chandler, on 24 July, uh, July 2012, 2012, and it's page 90 in English, the Khmer is 0082667879, French 00. 00 82865758 in English 0082885085 and he was asked the questions about biographies and part of his answer is uh, no I think I don't think that there's any sinister purpose in making or requesting members of the staff of S21 to prepare biographies. This was just something the party people and military people had to do from time to time. I think, no, I would say that this is not the purpose. It was just a practice that was universal. And, and so my question to you is, was it not a practice, sir, or was it a practice, was it a practice to write biographies, as David Chandler, the historian, seems to indicate. And I'm not, I'm not saying, we're not speaking about S21, we're talking about the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. I never wrote a regular biography, for example, every six months or so. I never wrote such a biography, but the, the very biography I mentioned here, uh, it was written under a special or extraordinary uh, circumstance following the allegation on me that I was part of the CIA agent. Okay, thank you. And in fact, uh, you've testified to that effect uh, on August 6th. Uh, it's in the transcript. Uh, that, uh, that's, uh, that's what you indicated. Uh, now, if we look at, and in fact, let me just go through that real quickly. Uh, it's page 102 in English. In my 2211 French 00833179, in English it's 00833289, and here you do say that Inkshiri called you, say Inkshiri called me to his office at the MFA, and he said that in the confession of Rao Sarin, who was the director of the Royal, of the, Royal of the Cambodian Avi Aviation, and was also my friend from Sisawat School. He was also a friend of Ki Chun in his confession as he was accused of being a CIA head. He said Ki Chun and I were also CIA agents, and for that reason, Ing Sri called me to his office to clarify the matter. Now, keeping that in mind, if we could... Uh, Go to D154.2. Uh, this seems to be a commentary on the revolutionary biography of Sun Sikun. Circumstances in which the biography had been written. Uh, do you have the document there, sir? And I'm referring to Khmer 0082462046 French 00290701220 in English 00082665 <laughs> President, uh, Council, can Le you please uh, repeat the ERN number in French because uh, ERN it was not clear for the record. Parce que le numéro ne Thank you. Pas I believe it's 00290701220. Uh, 
I hope we have the have it right. The document again is D one five four point two. And here, do you recognize the document, sir? Monsieur le témoin, est-ce que vous reconnaissez ce document? Um, yeah. To my recollection, Réponse. this biography was, uh, this document was prepared in French. I hand wrote uh, this document. I did not write it in Khmer at that time. So if possible, I would like uh, to seek uh, the original documents that I uh, hand produced uh, in, in French. Now, it starts by saying, first of all, La défense. It, is in, it is important to describe the circumstances in which my autobiography was written. This is from the translation, the official translation from Je this institution. La traduction officielle and then you institution. begin by saying, at the beginning of July 1977, Ng Sri called me into his office at B1, Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Democratic Kampuchea. Speaking in a grave voice, he asked me if I was in regular contact with Ross Serin. Jean former general manager of Royal Air Cambodia, a state-owned company. He uh, did not tell me Royal that Rosserin had been arrested uh, on accusations of being a CIA agent, in parentheses, U.S. spy agency. However, I had been laid, however, he had laid blame on me along with Ki Chun. Now, it would appear from your own handwritten commentary on your biography votre years later, many, many years later, uh, that you state here bien des plus tard, that Mr. Ying Shiri did not tell you that Ross Sarin had implicated you. Let me further go down before you answer the question that I'm about to pose. In the same page, it says, I did not realize the gravity of my situation until I read the confession of Tukum Dun many years thereafter in December 2001. And so here's my question, sir. Is it that you read confessions after 1979, and having seen your name in confessions, that you uh, mix things up, which is why we have this inconsistency be between what you testified in court and what you wrote in your book. Mr. President, I don't Réponse. seem to understand Monsieur the question being posed by the Council. Can the Council be directed to put a more precise question? The President, Council, please uh, put the question again to the witness and please try to avoid any leading question. I'll do so. Um, sir, uh, do you stand by what you wrote in your book where you say he, that is Mr. Ng Shri, did not tell me that Ross Sarin, Ross Sarin had been arrested on accusations of being a CIA agent, U.S. spy agency? Do you stand by that? Ma, 
Yes, I do. Oui. And uh, from your book here, on this very same page, it would appear that you read Turkham Doon's confession, you, became, you read it uh, after December 2001. Do you stand by that? I do not really understand the question posed by the council. Okay, sir, I'm, I'm, I'm uh, referring you to what you wrote. You say here, I did not realize the gravity of my situation until I read the confession of Toy Kondum many years thereafter in, 19, in December 2001. So, would it be right to say that it was after December 2001 that you actually saw the confession of Toy Kondum? Well, that, that is correct, because I Réponse. learned about that Cet confession by Toi Kham Dun following 2001. De Toi Kham Dun en 2001. And you noted that Question. you were a great historian. You told vous us this uh, on when you were testifying last week. Historian. On, uh, on August 16th, Le 16 août. Uh, as part of your uh, historical work and in writing this book, did you refer to documents and did you particularly look at S21 confessions of your colleagues? Et avez-vous regardé des aveux de vos collègues? Provenant de S21. I did not read the confession Réponse. by others when je I uh, was writing this autobiography. All right. Did you read Ross Sarin's? Confession. Avez-vous lu les aveux de Ross Sarin? I did read that confession, Réponse. but I I did it in 2010 aveux, when I discovered this confession at Los Lions and there myself. Yes, and that was the that, that was the point that I was trying to get at earlier. That subsequent to you writing your own biography, it was subsequent to that much later that you actually came across. S21 confessions. Is that right? Yes, that is correct. And I take it in reading those confessions, did you try or did you notice or was it apparent? When those confessions were made, and when you had been asked to write your own biography, par rapport au moment on vous a demandé d'écrire votre propre biographie. President, I am afraid I cannot quite catch Monsieur the question. Le
the president uh, council please repeat your question and uh, please uh, simplify your question because the question as we uh, heard it from Khmer is not uh, easy to understand thank you well when you were, when you were going through these confessions especially the confession of Sa of, of Ross Serin, did you reflect back or did you, did you pay attention to the date when it was written and think about when you were asked to write your biography to sort of try to link them? I am not sure of the question. I am still unclear. I'll move on. According to uh, Long Norin, in his statement of December 4, 2007, and I'm referring to document E3 slash 34. He indicates on page 4 in English, the Khmer would be 00204007 to uh, French 00491003. Four in English zero zero two three zero zero one three two two three five five six. He notes that it was you that asked him uh, to write his confession. To, I mean, to write his biography. My apologies. Is that correct? Did Long Marin get it right when he said? that you were the one in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs that asked him to write his biography. If you recall. Uh, yes, uh, that is that is correct because uh, he is a member uh, under my supervision. And that biography, was that one of those biographies that Mr. Yuk Chang talked about, one that is periodically made every six months, or was it another sort of biography as the one you've indicated yours was, if you recall? And if you don't recall, that's fine. The biography I asked Long Naren uh, to prepare was exactly the same in terms of format as the one that uh, Yang Seri asked me to prepare because we wanted to know whether Yang Seri was a uh, CIA agent when he was uh, leading the Cambodian student in Czechoslovakia. It was sometime in 1971 or 1972 when there was a riot uh, attacking the Cambodian embassy uh, in Czechoslovakia. At that time, Mr. Sisu Kunti was there as well. Mm. And Mr. in that Kunti particular circumstance, Mr. Long, Mr. Sarin was uh, alleged uh, that Sarin. the riot against the Khmer Embassy in Czechoslovakia was under the organization of the CIA agent backed by the United States. And they were infiltrated uh, in the uh, Cambodian front. So the biography prepared by Mr. Uh, Sarin was not prepared on a six-month basis, but it was prepared under special or extraordinary circumstance. OK, and we're speaking about Long Narin. Okay, thank you. All right. Uh, finally, with what re the time that's remaining, I just want to go back to one issue and, and have some matters clarified. And this is with respect to your contact with P. Poon prior to coming here to give evidence. And so let me go back. On August... 14th, 
2012, 2012, which would be page 104 in English, Khmer is 84, Khmer, and in French is 115 to 116. You say vous avez dit that he phoned me and I met him. This was what you told us on August 14th. So I want to be clear because when I asked you, you seemed to indicate that you called him. So which one is it? Did he call you or did you call him? Uh, we, there were two times when we called. Uh, the first one, Nous Mr. P. Poon told me that uh, he uh, got to Phnom Penh, and I asked uh, to meet him, but it was not at that time that I met him. It was later on when I uh, met him. And I asked him uh, where he was so Je that I uh, could go and see him at first my initiative uh, to uh, contact and meet him. And I can also clarify on that point as well Je that uh, if it was not me, I don't think that uh, he would uh, be willing uh, to meet. But because it was me, he could hardly say no to my request. Uh, okay, thank you. And so, uh, now, on the 15th of August, 2012, at page 49, and Khmer would be page 40 to 41, in French 52 to 53, you say, I cannot recall, recall it exactly. When he left Malai, that is, during the morning, he came to my house. He brought along a document that was around 6 a.m. And around 9 or 10 a.m., he was taken from, my, uh, from his house by the ECC vehicle from Malai to Phnom Penh. Here, you're telling us that he actually came to your house at 6 a.m. and gave you and brought along a document. Is that where the initial meeting took place? Yes, uh, that, that is correct, because he uh, brought along with me uh, the uh, document concerning his biography, which was published in the uh, Searching for Truth uh, magazine. And then he said that after giving uh, this uh, document to me, he would go to his uh, cassava plantation uh, to, uh, before uh, he left for Phnom Penh by the vehicle by the ECCC. Okay, thank you. Now, did he bring it on his own, or did you request his biography or his statement that he gave to DC Cam? It was at my own request because uh, there was, I learned that there was a publication of his biography, so I made that request to him. All right, thank you. Now you then go on to say, this is on the same uh, page, that uh, he did not have anything, and I also did not have anything. The president interrupts. Uh, Council, please hold on. Uh, Witness, you need to go to the restroom. Uh, Court officer, please uh, facilitate the witness what he needs.
President, Council, can you please advise the Chamber as to much how much more time do you envisage you need to put questions to this witness? Uh, thank you, Mr. President. I need about approximately 10 minutes. President, President, thank you, Council, for your uh, indication of times, but uh, the witness uh, is uh, fatigued now, so he cannot go any further. So court officer is now instructed to facilitate uh, the witness uh, to take a rest. How about the defense team for Nguyen Chia? Uh, do you have any questions to put to this witness in addition to the uh, document ruled upon by the chamber this morning? But can you advise the chamber as to how much time you envisage to put the question to this witness? Thank you, Mr. President. I uh, did have three questions relating to the document uh, that we are allowed to use, but uh, the questions I had have been answered in the course of the questioning by uh, my colleague, Mr. Carnivas, so I will take no further time. Thank you. Les questions de Maître Carnavas. Donc, je n'ai plus de questions. The President. Thank you, Council, for indicating je your clear position on this. Nonetheless, since uh, Budnes has some health reasons, he is not able to provide his testimony. Further, Il ne, pas en perhaps uh, I would like uh, the court officer to consult uh, with him whether he can bear with us for another 10 minutes, because after this he can si exactly be excused, uh, he can be returned to his uh, home after lunch or maybe during lunch. Jury uh, counsel for Mr. Uh, for the witness is also advised to uh, stay put and uh, remain in the courtroom in case uh, witness is able to come back for another 10 minutes because for 10 minutes uh, he would not need to come back tomorrow for the testimony he should do it today if he may. Il serait donc souhaitable que cela se fasse aujourd'hui. The President, Le President. Mr. Michael Carnavas, could you please indicate to the Chamber whether your remaining questions are very significant that you need to uh, speak uh, to him because he, uh, the witness important. indicates that uh, he is not able to give for the testimony today or even in the afternoon. Do you think that the remaining matin, questions qualify his present or return to the courtroom by tomorrow morning? Please advise the chamber on this. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. I already cut about a half an hour of my presentation because of the way things are going. Uh, regrettably, yes, uh, this is a point where I do wish to press uh, the witness to get some clarification. I think it's very important we had one witness testify, and it appears that there's a meeting now that it looks like from uh, the transcript that there may be something more to it. Uh, and so I do wish to have those 10 minutes pause, with the witness, y a des and I regret qui sont dans that he may have to come back tomorrow. J'aimerais disposer d'encore 10 minutes, et mm -hmm. malheureusement, le cas échéant, il faudrait faire revenir le témoin demain. My apologies. Mes excuses. Bah, 
the president. Thank you, Council. Since it is now appropriate time for the lunch adjournment, we will adjourn and we cannot continue to hear from uh, witness Suong Sikun. Even the remaining time for questioning is just 10 minutes, but we fully appreciate his health concern. Cela dit, la Chambre est consciente de ses problèmes de santé. In light of uh, the position stated by position Council Canavas, uh, Mr. Sung Sikun is instructed to be returned to the courtroom tomorrow for the 10 minutes matin session. Dans le prétoire pour 10 minutes d'interrogatoire. We feel that uh, witness has been questioned a lot and he, he is indeed under pressure a été for answering the questions and please uh, bear with us for just 10 more minutes for tomorrow morning. We would donc, appreciate that. Uh, doctors are also advised to check uh, examine his health condition immediately le to see whether he is now Fine. Counsel for Mr. Nunchia, you may now proceed. La parole est à la défense de Nunchia. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, our client would like to follow the proceedings this afternoon from his holding cell. He is suffering from a headache, back pain, and a general lack of concentration. And we have prepared the waiver. Nous avons préparé le document de renonciation. The President, uh, Council, could you please uh, be Maître, more precise? Is it your client request or you would like uh, to do that? Uh, so I think uh, the message in Khmer is not en uh, clear Khmer, enough. Cela pas été très clair. Uh, rephrase it. Uh, thank Maître you, Mr. President. Monsieur Just to be clear, uh, uh, yes, it is oui. our client that is suffering from a headache, notre client. back bien pain, mon client qui and a, mal a au dos general lack à la of tête concentration, and so he would like to follow donc lui the proceedings qui voudrait suivre holding cell. Audience depuis la cellule temporaire. The President, the Chamber le President. grants La such a request. À cette Mr. Nunchi is now allowed Monsieur to observe Nunchia the proceedings from his holding cell for the remainder of the day. Pour le reste de la he has indicated clearly through his counsel that uh, he has waived his right to participate directly in the courtroom. In light of that, the Chamber asks that Chamber Council for Mr. Nunchi submit uh, the Nunchi waiver signed or given sampled by Mr. Nunchi immediately. And uh, AV booth officers are now instructed to ensure that the AV equipment is well connected to the holding cell where Mr. Nunchi can observe the proceedings from there. Security personnel are now instructed to bring Mr. Nunchi and Kilsom Pond to their respective holding cell and return Mr. Kilsom Pond to the courtroom in the afternoon session by 1.30 p.m. The court is adjourned. Suspension de l'audience.